Welcome to the channel. My name is Matias. Today we're going to talk about Guardians of the Galaxy issues 4 through 6 that are tie-ins into the Secret Invasion crossover. The story that we get from Abbott and landing here stands on its own two legs. The crossover doesn't derail this whole series. It fits pretty neatly into it. So we have this accident on Nowhere where 13 people die and we discover that three of those people were actually scrolls. so everyone on Nowhere is freaking out. If you have a scroll infiltration, that always means bad news. And when this story starts off, we have this friction between the Guardians and the Luminals. As I mentioned in the previous video, they had two superhero teams on Nowhere. They are both investigating to see if they can find more scrolls. But the thing is, they keep getting into each other's business. In parallel to the story, we have the Time Displaced Major Victory, who keeps on getting attacked by Starhawk, who's trying to take them back to wherever they came from in the first place. So the story does pretty well, the classic story where everyone's paranoid that they don't know if the person next to them is a scroll or not and what the hell the scrolls want in the first place. And they have no idea of the scroll invasion on earth that's taking place. This paranoia gets so bad that the trust amongst the members of the Guardians is totally eroded away. Each character is going to try to resolve this problem their own way. But the thing is, Drax has a plan. Drax the Destroyer is pretty much hell-bent on trying to smoke out these scrolls, and his plan is to actually to leave everyone brain dead very briefly on the whole station because when dead, scrolls morph back to their original forms. So that's how Drax is going to identify them. So it's a very hardcore way to resolve this problem. So he sets off this bomb that basically it's like an electromagnetic pulse that leaves people brain dead for a couple seconds. He finds the scrolls and he discovers that Cosmo is the one hiding them. Cosmo was the head of security of nowhere. I totally forgot to mention he's a big part of the series too. But what we discover is that the scrolls that Cosmo was protecting, they're good, they're peaceful, they didn't want to be part of the secret invasion on Earth. They're able to convince the Guardians and the Luminal to let them stay on the base. They're not going to be into trouble. 